This is Dan Dominguez at the controls, and the next maneuver we'll see him perform is the wall. The wall is basically a violent vertical pull from straight and level to an abrupt stop with a nose pointing vertical. The wall is basically a violent vertical pull from straight and level flight into an abrupt stop with a nose to vertical, and from there you go directly into a hover. Entry into a wall is similar as entry into a hover, it's done at higher entry speed and with more finesse. To prepare for the wall, you'll need to master the basic entry into the hover. So start by flying normal straight line at a normal airspeed and then rapidly pull full up elevator while simultaneously cutting the throttle. Once the plane appears to be stopping in midair, quickly reapply throttle to maintain the hover. Timing the elevator and throttle inputs is critical for the wall. Maintaining throttle too long will cause the airplane to flop out at the top or simply continue on the vertical upline. Cutting the throttle too soon will cause the airplane to pull into a vertical attitude without the violent stop that we're looking for that makes the wall so spectacular. When properly executed, the wall will give the appearance of hitting the brakes on the airplane and coming to a screeching halt, momentarily stopping the airplane in midair. This enables you to enter a hover, harrier, or harrier rolls or anything you wish. Start by practicing at a medium airspeed so you can learn the timing of when to release the elevator upon entry. If you hold the elevator for too long, the plane will over rotate and you'll end up in a waterfall. The wall is one of the easiest 3D maneuvers to perform. Practice it at a good height and once you've mastered the basics, you can then easily bring it down lower. Just be sure to have enough altitude to allow your rudder to clear the ground upon your rotation at the bottom. This maneuver can be done upright, inverted, or either in knife edge. With practice, timing, and the right airplane, this maneuver is sure to be a crowd pleaser.